hey lovelies welcome back to another interesting video hope you all are doing well i want to thank god almighty for another bright and beautiful day today guys i'll be sharing with you how to diy amazing extreme air growth gel for your detangling for your moisturizing for your twist art your braid art for anything you choose to have for all air type i will go in with several spoon of my flax seed gel guys flax seeds are amazingly great on your air and this method I will be showing you all is super duper effective if you try it guys trust me you are going to love it so I will trust my jet my flax into my jar then over here I have my dry hibiscus flower guys hibiscus threatening your hair stimulate your hair give your hair that good volume like moisturizes your hair give your hair shine and help your hair to grow really really strong and healthy so right now I will go in with 400 ml of my cold water I will transfer it into my jar as you guys see me doing guys this gel is amazingly effective on any air type also on children's air you can as well apply this gel you are good to go so after i apply my water i'm going to stir the gel and the flax seed and the hibiscus uh, flower together as you can see me doing as you can see the hibiscus is bringing out its color already which is so great then I'm going to cover it up so I like to sit for 24 hours on a cool dry place okay I'm not going to boil my immediately no I allowed it to sit for cool dry place for 24 hours guys trust me you are going to love this method if you eventually try it so lovely is 24 hours later look at how my ingredients are looking look at the beautiful gorgeous amazing color guys the flax seed has bringing out all its nutrient and also the hibiscus flower has bringing out all the amazing nutrient as you can see there right now i will go in with my little pot that i will transfer my ingredient into my pot as you can see me doing Look at the gel, look at the flax seed, it's so thick as you can see. The other is my scoop to just scoop out the essential out of the jar. The other then I am going to stir everything together. Then I'm going to boil my for just 20 minutes. One, because I don't want it to come out that thick. And number two, I don't want to over process the flax seed and the hibiscus. I don't want to kill the nutrient. So I just boil mine for 20 minutes minutes so i will advise you don't over bread yours okay just bread yours for just few minutes and trust me just off your flame allow it to cool down then you scope the gel out of the ingredient so as you can see i'm just boiling my hibiscus and my flax as you can see together on a very very low flame for 20 minutes So lovelies, after 20 minutes, I, I like to cool down for another 10 minutes, then it's time to strain. As you can see, it's not that thick inconsistency. I don't want it to come out that extremely thick. And even though it's not that thick, it's still super duper effective. So I will just go in now with my little filter. If you don't have filter, you can use your stocks to just remove the gel out of the the hibiscus and out of the flaxseed. So right now, I'm just going to use my spatula to just remove the gel from the ingredient as you can see look at the beautiful amazing consistency guys this gel is super duper great and mind you if you choose to use this gel as a twist art as a braid art as a moisturizer please don't forget to use any butter of your choice to seal in the moisture so as you can see look at the beautiful color guys look like <laughs> 
<laughs> look like red wine so i'll go in with two spoon of my pure organic honey honey moisturizes your hair as antibacterial give your hair shine and give your hair healthiness and fullness so i will pour in my honey into my gel Then my next ingredient will be my castor oil. Castor oil thickens your hair, moisturizes your hair, stimulates your scalp, and make your hair to grow healthily, darker and fuller. Then I will go in with one spoon of my glycerin vegetable oil as well. This oil moisturizes your hair, gives your hair shine and healthiness. I will go in with one spoon as you can see. Then after that, I will go in with one spoon of my extra virgin olive oil. Guys, any oil you prefer, just apply. Then I will go in with one spoon of my grape seed oil. This oil penetrates into your hair cuticles and also gives your hair shine and moisturizes your hair as well. Then after then, over here I have my set of my essential oil. I will put the link down below. These oils are super duper amazing on your hair, your skin and your scalp. Then I will go in with some of them, not all of them. I will go in with my tea tree, I will go in with my eucalyptus, I will go with my lavender, and I will go in with my meat essential oil. I will apply five drops of each of these oil behind the camera. Then over here, I have my preservative. I will go in with 10 drops of my preservative to preserve my gel. If you are not using your gel immediately, I will advise you preserve it or you store it in your fridge up to one week. Then right now, I'm going to stir the gel together. So lovelies, this is how you can make your hibiscus and your flaxseed gel for detangling, for your pre pull for your twist and your braid art, for your moisturizing, for your dreadlock, for your finger core, and for all hair type, also for children. Right now, I will just transfer my gel into this my beautiful jar. This year, I will be storing my gel. Anytime I want to use it, I will just go in there and take any amount and I will just use so lovelies with this we come to the end of today's video if you want to use this gel as a moisturizer please don't forget to seal in the moisture with any butter of your choice and thank you all for watching if you like the video please give me the huge thumbs up and until i will see you in the next one until when i will see you on your screen next time remain blessed and in our peace bye bye